So, you've come to talk of Lady Iris. It's true, she has shared my fire from time to time. Sit down. Rest. I still remember that day, outside Ogar. The day I met her, the Lady Iris herself. Woods are so gloomy. Oh, why did I volunteer for this? I'd better keep moving if I'm to deliver this message. Where to? On it. this way. Almost be beautiful. We're lucky to have masks. Clouds be damned. A horror. This creature, it might have once been. No, don't think about it. It's just vermin now. Kill or be killed. Right away. Softly. Let me think about this. doing it. It's done. All this trouble to find some scholar. On it. Right away. A camp. So this must be... Lady Iris, I bring word from Ogar. The city is... Do I look like a scholar, Herald? The lady's gone on alone. Easy for her, but... I'd best go with you to deliver your message. Go low and throw. Hmm? Post me high. Mm-hmm. Take them down from above. Hmm? Right away. Mm hmm? Right away. On it. I'm ready. Okay. Where to? Uh huh. Mm hmm? Post me high. Uh huh. Yeah, right. Where to? Doing it. Carry on. Mm 
Угу. Ага. See that ancient beacon? Only one person can lighten. The lady passed through here. We need to cross. Let's check that salvage pile for something we can use. On it. Uh huh. Let's get on with it. Yes? Huh? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. What a messy stairway. On it. Yes? Hmm? Where to? Post me high. Mm-hmm. Almost there. The lady should be investigating those ruins. Who is this scholar? To go alone into places like this? I can hear horrors lurking ahead. Doing it. Yeah. Makes sense. Where to? Uh huh. Mm -hmm. Go low. A solid. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. On it. Right away. On it. Mm hmm. Uh huh. Yes. What? Huh? Uh-huh. Yeah. Yeah. Makes sense. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Hmm? Doing I'm it. Right. Where to? On it. Post me high. Yes? Uh huh. Mm. Right. Hmm? Uh huh. Go low and. Mm. 
Where to? Lady Iris, I bring an urgent request. Ogar expects an attack. The gates are... She listened to my message, or pretended to listen. It didn't matter. She knew what to do. If Ogar calls, we go. But if I am to tell you this story, it must be told from the beginning. This was our world. Then the Perlas appeared, and everything changed. They revealed a great secret to humanity, a great power, the Palido. We built ourselves a sublime domain. The Perlas glowed for us. Yet as time passed, we realized everything has a price. You all know what happened next. The Cataclysmo. The land was drowned in mist. And from this mist, on pale legs, emerged fresh horror. The survivors ran. They sought a new home, scrambling to higher ground to save themselves. That is how Ciudad Ogar was founded. The city where we have been surviving for generations. We made good time. The Solar Gate stands as firm as ever. But if the reports are true, the Gate will be under attack soon. Our scouts say the Swarm is arriving from the south. Take defensive positions. Huh? Hmm. On it. The night is nearly here. Prepare to fight. Here they come. Eyes open.
small for a swarm, and too easy. Lady Iris, no doubt the true swarm will arrive tonight. But with the small force we have... Then we build, Herald. Another defensive layer, out there. More walls? It's true, we have plenty of stone, but... sure these new walls stand firm. Not enough stone. We could use some sort of passage through our new structure. Not enough stone. It's a strong wall, Lady Scholar. But next to the Solar Gate, it's... Never mind. The Solar Gate has Merlons atop the wall. The Pallido shines. We will prevail.
Solar gate is adorned with banners too. Not enough wood. Yes, right away. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Me high. I'm on it. Pretty wall counts for nothing if no one is manning it. Let's go. 
It's no grand gatehouse, but I'll take it. Reinforcements have arrived. The city sends building materials and more troops. Sundown is coming. We need them on this wall now. Where to? The night is nearly here. This. Mm-hmm. Yes, right away. Our forest garrison should have felt the swarm. You think something happened to them? All I know them? is that the horrors have not been this close to the city in a long time.
That night, Iris defended the city gates from the horrors of the mist. With her peers in the order, our sworn defenders. Yet, this was not the first time Ogar stood against its enemies. Thirty years before that night, while the Order was once again fighting for their families, for all of us, a quiet sound began that would change our history. And when the Perla scholars opened their door, there she was. Between her tiny arms, a perla embedded in her chest. You already know, a perla is not a trivial thing. You could die just by touching one. And yet here was an infant with one of these things inside her. She'll die without us. She's a horror in disguise, I tell you. A horror. One looked on in silence. And when she stepped forward, all arguments ceased. She carries a bird light, yes, but also a book. Rectora Elena. She always seemed to understand things. Others could not. Do we not value knowledge? The child? The child is a beacon. Bring her in. Call her... Edis. So, the scholars of the ivory adopted the girl as their own child. And she grew like any other. Slowly, but steadily, always carrying her book, filled with stories from the past. But Iris was not any other child. As soon as the scholars allowed it, she became a chief defender of the city. And what does a good defender do when an attacker becomes too bold? She plays it smart. She goes in search of answers among the trees, beyond the walls. If we had known what she would come to face, Ciudad Ogar would have shut all doors and windows, and for the first time in centuries, prayed. Hmm, I see you've made yourself comfortable, Hermes. Right, bird brain. What say you to a ramble in the forest? I need to know what's going on. The garrison. It's in tatters. I never thought this place would fall. What falls can rise, Harold. We need to get this settlement working again. We shall need wood before all else. Constructing this will take a moment. We should build some steps to the sawmill while it is underway.
Excellent. The workers are gathering wood now. We'll need somewhere for folk to live. The air here, it's stale with mist.
got enough wood. Shacks are but the start. We have more work to do. But the day for us was nearly done. Masks on. They were waiting for sundown! Fight for your lives! Many. This... this cannot be how it ends. Rectora Elena, I I've been wondering... What would we do if one of our perlas got... I don't know... compromised? Would it be lost forever? That is a compelling question, little scholar. Our chroniclers say that in the lost reign, humans were able to fold the cloth of time itself for short periods. That way, even the most terrible mistakes could be undone. Of course, that Arte of the Palido was lost in the Cataclysmo. But with training, my little sage, I'm confident you will discover it again. Terrible mistakes? Undone? This is my only choice. To stop this. Have I... did it work? I can't believe it. I'm back. A few hours before the attack, it looks like. This is too much. We fell here. I... No. I cannot let this moment pass. Another chance. Another choice. We should gather some stone before... Lady Iris, are, are you all right? I am fine. Stone, you say? The bad we will prevail. We are needed. For Ogar.
these minerals. If we build a quarry here, it will gather stone for our walls. Well spotted. But our territory doesn't reach that far. At least not yet. Our territory now extends to the stone deposit. Let's start gathering. Do. Now, let's rebuild those walls. open. We will prevail.
Not enough stone. Eyes open, masks on. We will prevail. Filthy horrors won't reach us so easily now. Do not be so sure. Night arrives, and our rebuilding efforts have attracted them. Take positions. The night is nearly here.
this was only a bite at our ankles. They're testing us. You have no idea, Hogardian. Prepare for more conflict. Hiding won't be enough to survive the night. We have to put up a fight. Not enough stone. Low up. With the barracks ready, we can start training troops.
Oxygen is dwindling. Not enough resources. Not enough wood. use some traps around our walls. We lack citizens for that.
Mm-hmm. On it. Oxygen yeah. is dwindling. Not enough wood. Low oxygen production. Hmm? I'm ready. Yeah. Where to? On my way. Huh? Right away. Yes. Doing it. Not enough wood. Yeah. Mm. Post me high. I've got this. Not enough wood. Uh huh. Yeah. Yeah.
Oxygen is dwindling. Those spikes will be useful. What else could we do to better our odds? We shouldn't neglect the surrounding wilds. There's always useful salvage to be found out there. The Palido shines. We will prevail. Yeah? Mm-hmm. Night is nearly uh -huh. here. Good. Yeah, yeah. Night will be here soon. Let's use this time wisely. Mm. Yeah. On it. We are needed. That's right. Mm -hmm. Yes. We will prevail. throw. Makes sense. Not enough wood.
Not enough wood. Not enough wood. are needed. Masks on. Exhausted. Yet, we won. But that Arte, this folding of time, I feel... Lady Iris, take her, quickly! fell unconscious after defending the forest garrison. Iris, who is coming? So she told them what she saw. A dream. Or a prophecy. Your peddler. You are attuned to the Palido in a way none of us are. Your vision is not to be ignored. The horrors will get worse. Perhaps it is time, Rectora. That we sought once again the Alta Pearl? The Alta Pearl? Don't talk of that poison chalice! It is what the girl saw. Fabled to be the primal source of the Palido. A way to stop the horrors. It lies buried with our ancestors. Even those of the Lost Rain could not master such a thing. There is a risk, yes. But... Rectora, if this... Alta Pearl gives us a chance to undo the Cataclysmo. We should seek it. Iris, I know you're not like the rest of us, but every expedition for the Alta Pearl has... They do not come back. I saw it. It is... calling me. Your scholar is right. I have to go. We better prepare our troops. Let's not be hasty. It's the best chance we have. Death sentence. Enough. I've made a decision. It will be Edis's duty to travel through the old lands as our new expedition overseer. You will reach the Sea of Mist and you will travel beyond it, beneath it, in search of the Alta Pearl. Edis, please be careful. Whatever you find out there, promise me you'll return. I will. The Order avails. Hear that, Hammers? I'm in charge of an expedition now. You'll have to listen to me. Anyway, we better prepare. First things first. We need to found a settlement to gather ourselves. From there, we can push out. <laughs> 